This is an overview of Tyco Electronics TCS2 and Canusa CFTV heat shrink cable sleeves. TCS2 heat shrink is a cross-linked polyolefin sleeve designed for insulating and sealing both underground and aerial CATV connections. These include splices, amplifier connections, line extenders, splitters, couplers, and taps. The TCS2 heat shrink sleeve is designed to adhere evenly to all substrate surfaces, ensuring an environmental seal that protects against moisture and water migration. The sleeve is thermally stable and resistant to ultraviolet light and weathering. TCS2 is available in five sizes. Standard cut length is 48 inches. TCS2 7, 11, 13, 15, 17, 20, and 27. TCS2 has a higher shrink ratio than Canusa sleeves, therefore sealing a wider range of cable sizes and allowing for less stock inventory. The following chart shows the size comparisons. sleeve thickness comparison, we will compare the TCS2 1113 to the Canusa 13 and 1100 size. The TCS 1113 size, as supplied, is approximately 40 thousandths of an inch. The fully recovered is approximately 147 thousandths of an inch. The Canusa 1300 size, as supplied, is approximately 40 thousandths of an inch. Fully recovered is approximately 128 thousandths of an inch. The Canusa 1100 size, as supplied, is approximately 42 thousandths of an inch. And fully recovered is approximately 146 thousandths. Notice the difference in adhesive flow between the TCS2 and the Canusa samples. Installation and sleep recovery of both the TCS2 and Canusa can be achieved in approximately 40 to 70 seconds when recovered with a propane or MAP gas torch. Full recovery time of each will depend on cable or connector application and level of experience by the craft person. Each sleeve will be measured before and after installation to check for longitudinal change. There is little to no longitudinal change in the TCS2 sleeve. Longitudinal change in the Canusa sleeve is approximately three quarters of an inch. TCS2 and Canusa sleeves can also be installed using a hot air gun. Installation times will vary 
and will be dependent upon the heat gun type and cable or connector sizes. TCS2 and Canusa heat shrink sleeves both have thermochromic paint stripes to indicate that sufficient heat has been applied to the sleeve in order to recover properly. The green stripes on the TCS2 sleeve will turn amber only when sufficient heat has been applied for adhesive flow and sleeve recovery. The Canusa blue stripes will disappear as soon as heat is applied. To properly install TCS2 on a connector and tap, the sleeve should be pushed onto the connector and against tap interface. Heat the connector end of the sleeve first, 